the weather has been spectacular as of late, and you're going to be spending more of your time outdoors, especially this weekend. And you're going to want to be able to see what you're doing. Mm -hmm, but that's where Connecticut lighting comes in. If you're out there stumbling around in the dark, well, <laughs> <laughs> if you can't find the light you're looking for, regardless of the application, whether it's to light up your porch, a pathway, a beautiful tree, you want electric, you want solar, they have everything. I recently spent an afternoon with the president of the company to shine a light on this outdoor topic. Take a look. At Connecticut Lighting Centers, you'll find Todd Director, the president. Nice to see you, Todd. Good to see you. We're talking landscape lighting. We're talking outdoor lighting because tis the season. Tis the season. Weather's getting nice. Um, you know, time to you know start looking at the outdoor, doing the spring cleanup and everything else. And Connecticut Lighting has everything to offer. We absolutely do. You know, if you need outdoor lights, there, there's no place like this. You know, as you can see behind us, I mean, wall lanterns, flush mounts, hanging lanterns, styles, finishes, sizes. If you can't find it here, you're not going to find it. Let's start with porch and door lighting. So give us a little tour. Show yeah, us what you know, got. So, so again, um, all different types of looks. You know, uh, we, we're still seeing, especially in New England here, black is still a very, you know, prominent finish. Again, it goes with a lot of different types of, you know, house colors and sidings. I think it's stunning. It, it, it is. And, um, you know, a ton of different looks. You know, you're starting to see, how, uh, you know, the seated glass being incorporated, clear glass still very popular. We're seeing some water glass. And then as you look around, too, um, you know, just pay attention, you know, some of the different sizes. There, there's, you know, from extremely small to extremely large, all in the same look and same series. So then for your back doors, your side doors, your garage doors, your entryway doors, we have, a, we have the right size for every application. They certainly do. And certain fixtures are better for the shoreline than they are for inland Connecticut, right? Yeah, thank you for bringing that up. Yeah, absolutely. You know, we, we have um, fixtures that are actually designed for the shoreline. Um, actually, some, uh, like Quizel uses the phrase, coastal armor. So uh, it basically what they make it out of is a uh, high-grade plastic or a, or a polyomer. Um, composite material that will not corrode five-year unconditional warranty. Yeah, that's fantastic. Five years. That's a good warranty. Absolutely. Everywhere you look, there's a style for you. We have the hangers in the back, okay? We have the flush mounts up top, and then all the way around the whole back wall is all the post mounts. So if you have, uh, you know, a pole in your front yard and oh. you need a post mount to match your lanterns on your house, we have it all. And you, you light up my life. Just when you think you might be priced out, not so. This is Quizel. This is $97, less than 100 bucks for an outdoor fixture. They've even got these really cool lights for residential as well as commercial use. What are what so? So what they what they are? They're they're gooseneck lights is really what they are. Okay. Um, but the the nice thing about them is they're totally customizable from the standpoint of there's multiple different shade sizes as you can see. There's multiple different arm sizes and then there's multiple different finishes. So you basically build the fixture yourself. Where would you use these? These we're seeing a ton. We're seeing a lot of people doing barns, sheds, and also over garage doors. Let's move to landscape lighting, shall we? We're in the land of landscape lighting right now. Todd, you've developed this whole room to showcase the landscape lighting. And it might not be as hard as you think because it's low voltage, a lot of this. Yeah. One of the things about landscape lighting is it's really it's a plug-in box just like this. The reason why this is stainless steel is because it can be even plugged into an outdoor outlet or you can plug it inside your garage. But you start off with the transformer being plugged in, you run your low voltage cable off the transformer directly to your pathway lights, your up lights or whatever you're doing in the yard. Again, you, this is not line voltage, so you got your wire right here, um, you know, laid right in the mulch and uh, it's, there's really not much to it. That's incredible. So that's something that you might be even able to do yourself. Yeah, we, we get a lot of people who do it themselves. Um, you know, a, a, the, the big things in landscape lighting that make a difference, one, you got your color temperature, right? So again, you know, whether you're going to go warm or more cool, depending on the stones and the different accents, is, is really going to depend on which way you go. And then you also have your beam spreads and understanding, you know, how wide of a beam yeah. spread you should use for different trees and different bushes to, to light them properly. And that's what we'll help out with. Um, you know, when you look down here, these are actually a really cool item. These are swivel wall lights or step lights. We use them from a ton of different applications. They come from 3 inch, 6 inch, 12 inch in all different lengths and they also come in all different finishes oh, but cool. these can go under steps they can go on retaining walls they can go in all different applications and as you can see i mean they really do a nice job 
And last but not least, we're going to switch from lighting to mailboxes. Yes, Connecticut Lighting's your source if you're looking for a new mailbox. Todd, the letters keep coming and we need a place to put them. Mailboxes. Here at Connecticut Lighting. Yeah, yeah. It's um, it's hey, mailboxes are a great category for us. You know, um, I think one of the things is people just don't expect us to have mailboxes. But I think the other thing is too, it, a lot of the places that used to sell mailboxes just don't anymore. And really, you see the plastic ones, or you see the pretty simple, you know, just black aluminum ones. They, these are all cast. They're really nice. Um, bunch of different finishes and styles to choose from. And uh, yeah, they've been great for well, us. Who makes this? This is this. Uh, these two are spectacular. Yeah, they're they're cool. They're different. They're uh, you know they're really nice. Um, again, just well built, and just really add some nice curb appeal to the front and of your home. That's stunning. I, those I wanted to take those. If I needed a mailbox, I'd buy them. All right. Mm -hmm. So whether it's outdoor lighting you're looking for, or again a really nice mailbox, Connecticut Lighting has you covered. They have two locations: the brand new store on Murphy Road in Hartford, right off the old uh, Connecticut Lighting Center. So it's like a block away. Or of course they have Southington location. You can always visit uh, ctlighting.com for more information. All right. Some great options. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just hide the cord right in the mulch. Uh, That's right so in the mulch. great. Isn't that cool?